Merry Christmas, Squirrels, by Nancy Rose. Most squirrels spend their winter days hiding acorns in the snow, not Mr. Peanuts. He is a most unusual squirrel. Christmas is coming, and it is Mr. Peanuts' favorite holiday. He is full of Christmas spirit. He checks his mailbox every day for Christmas cards. One day, Mr. Peanuts receives a letter from Cousin Squirrel. Dear Mr. Peanuts, please come for a visit and spend the Christmas holidays with me. I promise it will be your best Christmas ever. Sincerely, Cousin Squirrel. Mr. Peanuts thinks a visit is a great idea. It will be fun to spend the holidays with his cousin. He gathers all his favorite Christmas sweaters. He has one for every day of his trip. He starts to pack. Who would have thought a squirrel could have so many things? Before he can go, Mr. Peanuts has to make a path with his snowblower. It is a little noisy for the other forest creatures, but soon his driveway is clear. Now he can hop into his convertible and drive to Cousin Squirrel's house. Don't forget to put the top up, Mr. Peanuts. When Mr. Peanuts arrives, Cousin Squirrel is very happy to see him. This Christmas will be so much fun now that I have a friend to spend it with, says Cousin Squirrel. Come inside. Cousin Squirrel brews a hazelnut latte for Mr. Peanuts. This is delicious, says Mr. Peanuts. Cousin Squirrel wants to show Mr. Peanuts that squirrels can have fun in the snow. What are these? asks Mr. Peanuts. Snowshoes, says Cousin Squirrel. Later, they go sledding. Mr. Peanuts zooms down the hill. Just look at that squirrel go! The two squirrels build an igloo. Now we have another hiding spot for our acorns, says Cousin Squirrel. They are, after all, still squirrels. Cousin Squirrel builds a snowman. Mr. Peanuts thinks the snowman looks very fashionable indeed. Next, Mr. Peanuts and Cousin Squirrel build a gingerbread train. It is the perfect size to ride in but Mr. Peanuts would rather eat it. He never gets treats like this at home. It is getting colder out here, says Mr. Peanuts. I know, Cousin Squirrel says. We should build a campfire. The open fire is warm and perfect for roasting chestnuts. Mr. Peanuts and Cousin Squirrel sing carols until the sun goes down. Time to go home, says Cousin Squirrel. It is Christmas Eve, and we have a very big day tomorrow. After wrapping presents, Mr. Peanuts and Cousin Squirrel sit in the warm living room by the fire and read together. Cousin Squirrel's favorite book is Twas the Nut Before Christmas. But Mr. Peanuts prefers the Nutcracker. They try to wait for Santa to arrive, but before long, they feel their eyes and their whiskers getting heavy. When Mr. Peanuts and Cousin Squirrel wake up on Christmas morning, there are lots and lots of presents under the tree. Cousin Squirrel has a present for Mr. Peanuts. He can't wait to see what is inside. Peanuts, he says. The 
This is the best present a squirrel could ask for. Mr. Peanuts has a gift from Cousin Squirrel too. What can it be? He opens it. You gave me peanuts too, says Mr. Peanuts. This is just what I wanted. Merry Christmas, squirrels. Thank you.